This is Techstep reported on a breaking news. We finally got the subtitle for the long-awaited Dragon Ball Z movie that is hitting Japan next year. The new title for the movie is Dragon Ball Z Revival of F. Or Revival of Frieza. Now, of course, why Frieza? Out of every character they could have brought back for the main antagonist of the movie, it had to be Frieza? Some fans were suggesting that Broly was going to come back, or even Evil Goku. Now, of course, they both sound stupid, but Evil Goku sounded totally original, while Broly sounded completely stupid, considering we got three movies on Broly, so why would we get another one was completely against the fans. But however, Frieza's back, we're gonna have to deal with it. In fact, I was honestly surprised, and this was unexpected. Frieza is currently the weakest of all the Z fighters, considering, I guess, Krillin can beat him up at this point in time. But, if you look at the poster, Frieza does look different. His aura has changed. It's now red, similar to Super Saiyan God's Goku's aura. Now, does this mean Frieza will be getting that power up? We'll find out. Now, let's look at this poster. It looks amazing. We get Frieza front and center, as of course he is the main antagonist of this movie. We get Goku and Vegeta in the background. Goku's outfit has changed. Now, this was to be expected, as many fans know from the end of the Dragon Ball Z anime slash manga series, Goku did change his outfit. So, this is probably the beginning of where he starts to change his outfit from his classic DBZ outfit to the one he has at the end. So far, the only notable changes here is that he removed the blue undershirt, and the symbol has changed from my point of view. On the right of Frieza, we get Piccolo, Yamcha, and Krillin, all in a charging and ready-to-battle position, as probably due to Frieza's return. And on the left of Frieza, we actually get Beerus and Whis, two characters I honestly were not expected to be in this movie. I mean, they were in the last movie, I thought that would be in it for their characters, but no, they're back. And I'm actually happy of that. And below of the poster, we get the two new characters, Tarbit and Sorbit. They are brand new original characters, all created by Akiri Toriyama. So, they look creative and original from a Toriyama's point of view. I personally love them. Now, we also get a plot synopsis for the movie. As it says, Earth, where peace has arrived. However, remnants of Frieza's army, Sorbit and Togma, arrive on the planet. Their goal is to revive Frieza with the Dragon Balls. Their dastardly wish is granted. The F that plays its revenge against the Saiyan is revived. And I'm going to be honest, it's kind of a generic plot. And that's it for what we got for the movie so far. We'll probably get more information as the month and, of course, 2014 wraps up. Now I want to hear from you guys. What do you guys think of the new movie and how you think about Frieza coming back? Do you think it's a good decision or do you think Toriyama is finally losing it? Comment below, and we'll see you guys next time.